What is going on, friends and gentlemen, Colts? I'm AK Dash, and welcome back to Amnesia The Dark Descent. Um, I actually have an interesting story from during the break. I walked outside. Whoa, okay, where am I? Okay, I'm outside the transept. Let me make sure my fingers are on the right keys. Um, um, I walked out of my room to change my laundry. And then I realized I had left my key and my student ID on my desk. Okay. This room is interesting. Well, I'm guessing there's no monsters in this little area. This one, prepare him. Guessing. Okay, here's a door. Um. So there's two doors. I see another two. Uh, let's pull this out. I think I'm going insane. So three doors. And then there's a fourth door. Um, I'm just kind of pulling this lamp out so that I don't go completely crazy. So, four doors so far that we found. Five. And I think this one is the one we came in. Oh, six? Uh, this one's the one we came in? Uh, okay. Where's the door we came in? Okay, more the door we came in. We didn't... That sounds wrong when I say it the other way. Uh, let's close that. Where did I walk in the room? Oh, I'm confused right now. Alright, let's go back the way we came, I suppose. Oh, gosh. Oh, God. The cradle is ready. Good. You! You're a man! How can you partake in me? Is he all right? He is one of the wicked. Don't pay his lies any attention. I'm not a bad man! It was an accident! He set a man on fire. It wasn't my fault! Why won't anyone listen? That's horrible. Of course. We are dealing with monsters here. Okay. Well, there appear to be, like, torture devices on the ceiling. Oh. There's this big spiral staircase. I don't know if I want to go up there yet. So, he mentioned a brute, which is why I got scared, because that's... The name of the monster is the kill us in one hit. I guess we have no choice but to venture forward. Or, whoa, I see something hiding. Is that the ore piece? Looks like it. Anything else in here? Okay, we got a piece of orb. Now let's get the hell out of here. So otherwise we'll probably go insane and shut this off. We have a slight headache. I think there's six orb pieces. So we had three and then we have a fourth. Um... I doubt there's a reason to come back in here. Even though I'm pretty sure that's where I came in the uh, transept initially. 
So how do I get out? Okay, there's a light in here. Thank goodness. Um, tinder box. Bunch of stuff to throw around. Anything useful? Somewhere to hide. Can we interact with this? Oh god. We just tortured the crap out of somebody. You know, in the past. I have a feeling that because of this wardrobe here that the orb was in, we're gonna encounter a brood on our way back. And we're gonna have to come in here and hide in the wardrobe. Yup! Or maybe that was just a shadow. Who knows? I'm keeping my light off. Okay. Come on, close you dumb door. Uh, it just closed on its own. So it's one room, two rooms. Okay, this is where we came in the first time. Three rooms. I'm scared. We are completely insane. One shot. What the... What the hell? They're sawing his balls off. Ooh, a tinderbox. Um... There's the orb piece. The rapist hanged upside down, his tears swelled with blood flooding from his belly. The saw between his legs had lodged itself in the, in the hip and wouldn't move any further. The man stepped back and waited for the victim to drain. Oh my god. Why? Oh god, there's the thing they did it with. Oh god, why? I want to know what's upstairs. They wouldn't have put it in the game if we didn't have to go there. Okay. So this is the first room we went in. One, two, three. Back the way we came. Alright, let's head upstairs. Even though we have six pieces of orb now. Imagine there's something we have to do up here. Okay. Um, our sanity. Oh, crystal clear. Cool beans. Jesus. Alexander, let's not look at him. Uh, we're stuck. It's like Alexander's study or something. Tinderbox, overturned chairs, a string or something, oil, we got oil for days, actually no we don't, we should probably add some, okay, that's good, I think the um, remaining oil jar is not, okay, let's wait to pick that up, um, is more than um, 
what we currently need. Is there another thing in here? Okay, so let's do this. We'll read the note. Notes on torture. There are quite a few things to be said about torture. I figured the reaction I would get from the victims would be highly individual. Thankfully, this is not the case. Humans all have a very similar approach to dealing with physical pain and the terror of anticipation. I can't stress enough the importance of restraining the victims before we proceeding. Even the most timid creature can break out in fits of violence where the strength exceeds their expected prowess. If proper care has been put into healing, into breaking the victim, sorry, um, this should not be a problem. But it will also hinder the effect I am after. Uh, the, the right steps to take are, therefore, to restrain while the victim is dazed, proceed by presenting the form of torture you are about to apply, and then continue with the actual act. Right steps to take are, therefore, okay, um, the point of the presentation is to induce terror. The human mind is extremely efficient, as it will trigger itself into greater fear simply by imagining it. While applying pain, make sure to avoid some massive damage as it will prove more efficient if the process can be sustained. Also, apply the pain in doses, if possible, with breaks to let the body settle. If you are whipping or cutting the victim, strike once, wait for the pain to subdue, and strike again. As long as the body suffers, it will continue to produce the vitae and saturate the blood with its properties. Only with careful performance will the victim yield maximum effect. If the victim doesn't behave as expected, it is likely that all will be for naught. Before this happens, feed them the amnesia drink and try again later. So that's probably what we took. We stole it from our victims. Is it you, my love? I miss the most, or is it perhaps myself? I know what I have become. I am not blind. I am a monster to them. A demonic sultan perched on the dark mountaintop. There is little I can do to redeem myself. The black eagle fears me, and after Napoleon's defeat, it is only a matter of time before they will demand my head on a platter. I must remove myself from this land. This time it must work. I, if I can't return home now, I shall perish. He picked up a string. Oh, I hit the wrong button. I have a feeling that, well, I guess we can just head back to the nave, wherever that is. It's not this. It's this, I think. Nope. The other one. I hope. Um. Uh, The name. Uh, it's getting a little old reading these loading screens multiple times. I want to try something. Let's go back to the transept. Um, and then we'll turn immediately around. Okay, so it puts us here. We just like walked around a time and a half or something. So I'm wondering, is the piece of string for the, uh, our little water-dwelling friend? Um, what? Uh, I'm running. I see that all the old pieces you need. I know I have no right to ask anything of you. But if you could find it in your heart to gather the ingredients for bias tonic before attempting to mend the all, there might still be a chance for you to see me. Please, my faith is in your hands. Okay. So... Um... We have a string. A tough string made of hemp, specifically. That I hope is supposed to help us with our water-dwelling friend. Come on, let me up. Uh, you can't use this item this way. Now, if we just try to use something random, let's say nothing to use the item on. So we're supposed to use something on here. Can't use the item this way. Nope. Nope. 
Oh. Oh, there we go. We've tried that before and it didn't really work. Um, somebody is pulling the rope. Uh, what do we do? So, we pull the fish up. What have we here? Picked up remains. I see that all the all pieces you need. Shut up. Alright, where's the door? There it is. I don't know why I'm coming in here, but this is where we found the our original note. Okay, so we have... Okay. Notes. Uh, vaccine trials? Is that what we're looking for? Gripper channels where? Okay, a paralyzer, vitae, and tamter. Um, tamter, a property of the secretion in the water-dwelling cairn. So that's going to be on the remains. Um, we have the poisonous fungi. Um, the vitae could be extracted as usual from any agonized victim's blood. Um, we don't have, do we have agonized victim's blood? Um, hmm, interesting. So, uh, oh, we can put that down. Um, Where's tab? Oh, I just hit caps lock. Um, we put this down here. Can we combine items like this? Combination does not work. Uh, what about this? Can't be combined by hand. According to the note, the tonic has to be made with care. Okay. Um, combination doesn't work. So I'm guessing we have to put the glass jar down. Can I use this item this way? What can we use this way? Except I actually read that's completely obsolete. Um, oh. What's this? Um, it's like clipping through the floor or something. Anyway, so we're supposed to use something here. Bucket of tar, poison gland, not the horde pieces, string. How do we get the vitae? I really hope we don't have to go to the torture chambers again. Um, I'm thinking maybe we may be able to get it from one of these side rooms. Yeah, after the minute secured, the prisoner of the ritual began. Okay, we can't use items on here. Um, so that just tells us that the ritual began. This is where the dude was. Oh well. Whoa, what was that? This is probably something to just pick up. Uh, come on. There it is. It seems to be something to pick up. Some sort of torture device. Um, let's head back to the nave. How do we get this uh, vitae? 
Um, and how do we combine the items? Um, anyway, I think I'm going to end the episode here and look it up. I make a dash, and I'm out.